from the uh, Katanga Copper Crescent in the Congo. Now this is an absolutely stunning formation of uh, cobalt and calcite crystals jutting down. Now this uh, this material sitting with the cobalt and calcite uh, on the still pictures, I didn't get it out clearly either. Let's see if we can do that on the uh, could very well be El Corwezite or Girthite. I don't think I don't think it's it's malachite. Um, I talk under correction though. Uh, we'll just let's have a look behind. Let's see if we can get a closer zoom in on those. It's <coughs> it's little uh, botroids, um, or it appears to be botroids. Might li most likely little bushes of hairs. Could very well be a uh, colwezite. Quite typically associated um, with the cobalt and calcite in this in this mine, which is the. Mashamba West Mine, the Katanga Copper Crescent. What is quite amazing is this wonderful form of the, the cobalt and calcites. Have a look at this this formation. It's almost a, wow, really, really nice. I like this. Now, cobalt, uh, uh, cobalt well, calcite is typically cubic. The fracture would be cubic. But in this case, we have the dog tooth crystal formation, which is, which is uh, readily available from the Congo, but not all that common. It just and this is all from the Mashamba West mine. Um, let me just see if we can zoom in on those. Um, I'm trying to. I, I need to look under magnification. So it's either Colwezite or, or perhaps Girthite. Please look at my description.